I think that for the last eight years, this country has been going in completely the wrong direction in a way that's damaging not only uh, regarding our relations with foreign countries, uh, not only foreign policy, but also domestically. Uh, We have a horrible deficit, we're in a recession, the economy is terrible, and we're risking at this point also to lose a lot of our civil rights uh, are at risk, I think. So it's an important election. It's not an ideal world where the, one, one can see the sharp, sort of say that they're all the same. It's all part of the American two-party system, which is, you know, has advantages of efficiency unlike the parliamentary system but ideologically it, it tends to make everyone seem the same certainly from a global perspective the, the first time we elected Bush it was controversial you know there could have been a question of doubt but the second time you know my, my people made the same mistake again, and I have friends from all over the world, and my first thought, honestly, when I, when I was watching the news is, my God, what, what must they be thinking about us right now? That... And I felt like at least I was able to present a different point of view and not, not make the impression that people must have of people from the United States is so flat, you know. It's kind of a wake-up call. You know, what happens when you just let people not, you know, do whatever they want and not be regulated in the name of the free market? You know, it's not a good mix. They're they're not going to police themselves. They're they're gonna, you know, try and trick each other and like make as much money as possible. So, so yeah. Obama è un simbolo di, della speranza perché do, dobbiamo cambiare um, l'immagine degli Stati Uniti ne, negli occhi del mondo. Sono tanto delusa con uh, il governo degli Stati Uniti per uh, sei, sette anni. I'm very pessimistic, but uh, it could be, uh, you know, one of those classic lesser of two evils, and in that case, Obama might do less damage. Uh, that's what I'd like to say.
states. And one of the main tactics of the McCain campaign has been to call Obama a socialist because he wants to give tax benefits to the poor and obligate, uh, oblige the rich to pay more. And everyone says socialist, socialist, socialist. And I think this is a particularly American phenomenon where a lot of people don't understand, first of all, that the principle of income tax is socialist and that it's not an evil thing, that it's necessary. Cocky and loaded never seemed a good combination. I feel incredible, angry, like everybody. I think banks should, act, the function that banks perform should be, should be social, socialized. There should not be a private banking sector. That is a right, the right of credit. It should be owned by everybody. We should all be able to demand credit. That is, if I need money, I should be able to go get money. I know it sounds utopian, but it's not. Sound pretty crazy? Okay. Um, I think they, they should work on their foreign policy because right now they're in Iraq and like the war is very, it's very convoluted and right now people really have mixed feelings about the war. They want to get out but they want to stay. So I think they were, should work on their foreign policy a lot. Uh, Pakistan, Afghanistan, mm. Sarà molto difficile per il nuovo presidente, è evidente. Obama is at least willing to attempt to have diplomatic, open up diplomatic relations, which is probably a much saner, more intelligent than thing to do. Uh, but I don't, I don't know, I don't know if I trust what they're saying publicly, you know. I would hope that. Uh, the soldiers in Iraq will immediately be returned home and um, I think that the economic crisis needs to be addressed in a way that it isn't being addressed right now and I think that'll be definitely one of the more important things that the, the new president does is to address the economic crisis. Ma per me è una sorpresa come um, l'economia del mondo è, caduto, è caduto nelli, nella la, nell'ultima mese. È incredibile. I just want to differ there with what's called normally American exceptionalism. That is, we're the exceptional country on the planet that has to lead all you little lost sheep out there who don't know what you want to do, you know? Well, I've traveled in the world and I think you have some idea of what you want to do. That's all. That's all. I definitely think that um, the president should uh, deal with some of our economic problems. I don't think um, sort of continually bailing out Wall Street is a good idea. Bush? Bush? Non avevamo paura che lui sia un socialista. Dunque, è molto interessante e quasi ironico. Well, this is the question, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. 